understanding, to gel with someone, a friendly guide. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that's quite common in English conversations, to gel with someone. This expression is all about relationships and how we connect with others, but what does it really mean to gel with someone? Stick around as we explore this phrase in detail, providing you with examples and insights to help you understand and use it confidently in your own conversations. To gel with someone is an informal phrase that means to get along well with another person. It implies a smooth, effortless compatibility where understanding and rapport come naturally. Think of it as two substances mixing together perfectly without any lumps or separation. That's how this phrase applies to human interactions. When you gel with someone, it means there's a strong sense of mutual understanding, shared interests, or values that make spending time together enjoyable and easy. It's not just about agreeing on everything. It's about feeling comfortable and in sync with each other, often right from the start. The term gel originally refers to a substance that is neither solid nor liquid but somewhere in between, like hair gel or gelatin. From this, the metaphorical use of gel in relationships conveys a sense of two or more elements coming together to form a cohesive, unified mix. This expression became popular in English-speaking cultures as a way to describe relationships that work well, highlighting the importance of compatibility and ease in social interactions. Let's look at some examples to better understand how to use to gel with someone in everyday conversations. I really gel with my new coworker. We've been collaborating on projects seamlessly. It's amazing how well I gel with my partner's family. It feels like I've known them for years. Despite our differences, I gel well with my roommate because we respect each other's space and habits. In each of these examples, the phrase highlights a natural, positive connection between individuals. Building rapport and gelling with someone doesn't always happen instantly. Here are a few tips to help you gel with others. Be open and listen actively. Showing genuine interest in the other person's thoughts and feelings can set a strong foundation for a good relationship. Find common ground. Shared interests or experiences can be a great way to connect and gel with someone. Respect differences. Acknowledge and respect your differences. Sometimes, contrasting perspectives can enrich your relationship and help it gel. We hope this video helps you understand what it means to gel with someone and how you can apply this knowledge in your social interactions. Remember, gelling with someone is about finding that perfect mix of compatibility and mutual respect that makes relationships rewarding. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more insights into the English language. Happy learning!